What do you want, human? You're crowding my hump. So you're in charge of Erdnot scouts. Why waste your time shooting at vermin? Ammunition is the one thing we're not hurting for on Tachanka. As scout commander, I have to set an example. Plus, the little bastards get into food supplies if their numbers get too high. Can't have that. You see a lot of action around here? Enough. Varen here and there, and snakes in any of the water safe enough to drink. Rex has made ceasefire agreements with some of the clans, but I still have to patrol, keep them honest. What does a scout commander do? We find out where the enemies are, and we make them think that there are too many of us to screw with. Sometimes that means harassing the perimeter, taking out a generator or two. Other times, we play hide-and-seek. We leave lots of tracks, exaggerate our numbers. That's not recon, that's sabotage. It's a lot easier to count their numbers once you blow some of them up. Everyone knows where Erdnot is, human. It's not like we can hide. So every clan on Tachanka encroaches on the other clan's borders? Borders? This is Tachanka. Our borders are determined by the range of our guns. We are what we are, human. If we didn't fire at them, they wouldn't take us seriously. Don't your storehouses have automated defenses? Why bother? Half of what we eat is vermin. And if we get hold of defense systems, we don't use them to guard grain. We've got weapons stockpiles to take care of. Beyond that, our women and children get the security. Taking care of your food supply would help more in the long run. If Clan Jordan kills our guards and helps itself to our well-secured food, there won't be a long term. This is Tachanka. Having power and clean water means we're living in luxury. Your enemies go after civilians? Easiest way to wipe out a clan. Women and kids can fight, but they're always outnumbered if another clan goes after them. If it's women and children are killed, a clan's hope for the future is lost. It falls apart. We don't do that, though. Rex's orders. Even if it costs us a battle, we don't fire on non-combatants. Thanks for the information.